here, friends. If I offered you one of these bills right now, which one would you take? $50 or $1? You'd probably take the $50 because it has more value than the $1 bill, and $50 is worth more so you can buy more things. Sometimes people treat others like these two bills. All people have value, but they think one person has more value than the other. They may treat people differently based on what they look like, where they're from, who their family is, or based on what they can and cannot do. But these things don't give people value or take value away. Today we're going to talk about the one who gives people great value no matter what they look like or who they are. And that one is God. Say it with me. I am valuable to God. We have learned that God has made each of us unique in our own way. But did you know that God made people to be just like Him in certain ways? This is called being made in God's image. Like God, you and I are creative. We like to make things. I like to make these videos. Some of you like to build things with Legos or make slime even. Like God, you and I also can love. Like God, you and I can communicate and express our thoughts. We are able to relate to God to, and to other people and even with His creation. People are like this because we are made in God's image. Animals are also wonderful creations to God, but they aren't made in God's image like you are. God created people to know Him and to love Him. And God wants you to know that you are valuable. You are loved by Him and made in His image. God's love for, you, love for you started even before you were growing inside your mom. In Psalm 139 verses 13 through 14 says, For you created my inmost being. You knit me together in my mother's womb. I praise you because you, I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Your works are wonderful. I know that full well. Did you know God gave you the eye color that you have? Maybe it's the same as one of your parents, or maybe it's the same as your great-grandmother, but God chose that eye color just for you. Or maybe the texture of your hair. God gave you all the DNA in your body that you will ever have. The DNA is inside every cell in your body, and it determines what you will look like and how your body will look, work. Not only did God make your body, but He also made the personality um, as you were growing in your mom. There is no one exactly like you. God put thought and care into making you because He loves you. There are many things that people think are valuable to them, like money, cars, houses, even smartphones and computers. But to God, people, His creations, are more valuable than any of these things. Remember, your value comes from God. Maybe a bully says mean things about you and you wonder if they're true. Maybe people in your family say you are worthless and even hurt you. You may wonder if you actually are worthless. When others hurt your feelings or your body, remember those things they are doing is, are sinful, they're sin. Those bad things don't determine your value. God says you are valuable. He is the one who gives you value. You can trust that when God says you are valuable because you are. You are made in His image and you are precious to Him. You don't have to do anything to earn or keep your value with God. When you believe on Jesus, God says you are His child, and so you are. You can trust that what God says about you. If someone is hurting you, it is always good to talk to God about it um, and also talk to a safe, trusted adult. God might use that person to help you. No matter what other people say or do, remember, your value comes from God.